John's coming at nine o'clock, it's 8.30. I need to move these ices, they've been here too long. Uh, 30 minutes, that's cutting it real close, especially since it's one of the tougher moves on the farm. John's coming to look at his cow, Nellie, spend some time with her without his kids around. That'll, that's before we actually deliver her the first week of August. Hey, good morning, ladies. Oh, that's sweet. You're coming right up to me. When we first got you, we couldn't get it within a hundred feet of you. I'll give you a little head rub. I'll give you a little head rub. She likes it the way she likes it. There they are, and there they need to go. Well, I guess I won't be moving them because three chickens are out. This box, this nesting box was like that, and some of them found their way out. Uh, you guys need to get out of here. They're going to start tearing up this pasture. Well, I'm not too upset about it because we're really pressed on time and there's nothing I can do about it. Maybe I can catch them? <laughs> How many times have I run around this coop? Got it! Oh! Ah. ah, got one. Yay. There's John. Come to see the cow. Right on time. 8.59. Jonah, will you go help him catch Nelly and let him handle her? We got over here. Hard part's way done. Already got one fence up. Working on the second fence. I maybe lack five, ten minutes at the worst. All right, that was a strong 30 minutes. Broke up a little sweat, but you know what? This right here makes it all worth it. Animals on new grass. <laughs> you love it. You love it, you already caught a bug. All right, we finished. Let's go see John and Nelly and get the cows down for milking. The New Yorker's back. You gonna spend some time with Nelly? Good. Start handling her? Yeah. Good. Yeah, she, she she likes getting pet a certain way, doesn't she? Yeah. So you have goats. I think they would be she would be a companion with goats, even if they're Nigerian dwarfs. Um whatever we'll keep a goat in, we'll certainly keep a cow in. Okay. John, we're gonna go get the other cows and she's in heat, so stud muffin's probably gonna try to come down. Let's have you walk her. You wanna spend some more time with her, right? So go Walk her down the road. I would say go to the no trespassing signs. Right. And hang out there until you see us go past. Till you see us, if Stud Muffin comes, till you see us bring him back up. Okay. Okay? Sounds good. All right. When Nellie's in heat, Stud Muffin does not like anybody to get separated from the herd. So my plan is to herd him back and have Jonah herd Flossie. Come on. Here we go. Round her out, stud. All right, come get her, Jonah. She's going the wrong way. There we go. We don't want him to jump the fence or anything. Come on in. Now we got stud muffin safely over here. Jonah's got Flossie. And Phyllis isn't following. And Phyllis is doing great. She's totally, completely dried off from right here. All right, I think Jonah's got well ahead of me. All right, I just realized now Stud's by the road and John's gonna come walking by with Nelly. That's not gonna be, oh, see? Hey, hey, hey. All right, hey, Rebecca, go drop that fence where Flossie is so that Stud can get in there. That was a good call getting Nelly out of here. That would've been a mess. Now, what are we gonna do with you, buddy? Let's get you in here. Go in that stall. Wow. Boy. I'm lucky. All right. There we go. I will say, I, my first instinct was to get a, a gate between me and him. Yeah. My first instinct was to come around and shut the gate in our, in our fence. I was like, I need you to help me 
get Mama, some trash dealt up. with down here. Okay. Any of these sprouting? Right here, the collards are sprouting. Yay. The collards want to live. The cauliflower wants to live. Romaine sprouting. Yay. Butter crunch is sprouting. All right, you need help so, getting this bag out. Celery and spinach. Brussels sprouts are sprouting. Look who I forgot about. <laughs> That's all right. You gonna clean up around our greenhouse? You gonna clean up around our greenhouse, Miss Thang? Jonah, come down here, buddy. All right, go ahead. Open the, open the, hold it. Oh, not that way. Oh, that's definitely flowers. She obviously doesn't care about maintaining a pretty garden. Oh, Phyllis, there you go. What is going on here? Doing it twice. Okay, good. First time milking, John? First time milking. Okay. You make it look so easy. Yeah, so that's what happens. Squeeze, right? That's what happens when you've done it for three years, almost seven days a week. There's a tray of Brussels sprouts and broccoli. That should probably come out then, too. My right hand's my dominant hand, but I feel like it's way better with the left hand. Mm. All right, so we got this these tables at Sam's, they're amazing. They're waterproof, inexpensive, collapsible. I like working with those. That's an outdoor nursery right there. It's too hot, way too hot to put them in there. It gets like over 100 degrees. Till we figure out a way to ventilate it better. Yeah, which is on the list. Yep, long list. Long list of everything to do. Oh, now I hear you going. I told you the left hand is so much better for me. Man. All right, I'll try to help you now, John. All right. So, how was milking the first time, John? I can see, uh, see how it could be very tiring in the beginning. Sore hands. So tired. Yeah. But let me tell you this. It took me, I think, an hour the first time. It's going to take 30 minutes, day two. Like, you're going to double. You learn quick, is what I'm saying. I wish that wouldn't have happened. All right. Oh, gosh. <laughs> He's going in the center. Okay, let me out of here. Oh, there we go. Now he'll go. There we go. This is the big uh, teddy bear. That looks really good, Josiah. Good job. You eating morning glory? Yes. Eat all that you want. Good guy. He's a really manageable bull. He's been a good one for us. Papa? Come on, you rambunctious young boy. Here, we need to check his collar, huh? It is. It's, it's still loose. Rebecca, it looks so much better in here. Hold on. Doesn't this feel a little better? I mean, maybe so we'll get dust on your paint job. We're gonna get job. plastic up on here. Yep. When we get that done. Block off the insulation. When we get that Keep done, on. then I'm gonna vacuum the walls to get all these nasty cobwebs that are 20 years old off. Isn't this a nice area? It is so nice. It's cool. Then we're gonna tackle the stalls. We're gonna yep. organize all of everything in there. We've got so many stalls, guys. There's no reason. For hay in one, worm bin in the other, See, buckets in one. See, part of it was is that you were just surviving. Yeah. But now I'm, now now I'm on. Like, I could have never gotten to this. All right, let's go eat. Okay, let's go eat. Gosh. That's what we're doing all this for, to eat. Another day, another bunch of meals from the land. We probably ate 90% from the farm this weekend, Anna. Mm -hmm. It was amazing. And what is that you're putting on it? It's green Ooh. salsa. That's our tamatillo. Tami, tamatillo. 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 Salsa. Where's, where's Jason? We need him to. I think he just left to get some supplies. Help us. Say Unless that. he gave up. <laughs> Didn't even say goodbye. Jason's here working on our cool room. Mama, Papa. Mm. I go in the way guys. That's why we do this. That's why we get up in the morning. Hey Jason. What's up? Okay, it's tomatillo. Tomatillo? Ta tomatillo. See? Tomatillo. Tomatillo? I don't there know. You go. <laughs> yeah, how do you say it? Tomatillo. Tomatillo. The how L's, do you say it? The L's are like a Y. Tomatillo. 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 Did I just say it? Tomatillo. 
<laughs> okay, tomatillo. Put some of that tomatillo in your mouth. I did, it's so Is good. Is it good? Like we gotta give Jason some of the tomatillo sauce. Yeah. Or do you like it spicy? We don't like it spicy, it's well, not spicy. Well, it's fermented green salsa. Oh, that's good. Rebecca, the creaminess of that yogurt. No, look at this. It's so smooth. It's normally not that smooth, it's usually chunky. We have a little bit, we have to like yeah, mix in the way. I think this that's is because that's flossy in her creamy milk. That's the only thing I can think of that has changed. Well, and we weaned Bessie. Yeah. Yeah. And that's why Flossie's giving creamier milk, right? That makes it worth it all right there, that creamy yogurt. Oh! Look who's back. <laughs> You're a Monday, Tuesday kind of guy. Yes. You've got the floor screwed in. Screwed in. Uh, ceiling insulation is done. And now I'm just dry fitting the, this wall for insulation. Yay! That's gonna go pretty quick. So yeah, so my goal is to do, get this insulated and then this wall insulated. Uh, and then hopefully this one. So all of it insulated and then start putting in the three quarter inch plywood. Hey, we found a door. We were gonna buy a door, like a freezer door, fridge door, and it was gonna be like $3,000. Wow. And then we found one on eBay. Really? For a thousand. Okay. So I think we do that. You might have to do the frame a hair different. Right. Like you might have to bring it up or something. Okay. But I figure that's not gonna cost us $2,000 <laughs> to get you to do that, right? Yeah, that's great. Hey Rebecca, have you ordered that door off of eBay yet? No. Should you run it by Jason? Yeah. Man, this is like Insulation. really nice and solid. Yeah, I was thinking too, maybe the floor, like maybe putting in some like rubber mats or something. After yeah, it's all, all I like that. That would help too. So, okay, so then I found this one. Now it is shorter than our door, but uh, you could work that in, right? I mean. Yeah, is this dimensions right here? Yeah. So it's. 33 and a half. Well, it says, it, it, was, it was saying that it's 34, 34 by 78. Yay. 34. So that's 79 from that floor. So yeah, actually we could probably build up this bottom part here. Since oh. this is exposed anyways. Okay. Just put some two by fours in there. Yeah, and then I think it's like literally like maybe a half inch, but you could just, I could just trim up a two Something. by four. Just rip a two by four and just put a half inch in there. Okay. So it should work. Sweet. All right, saved us like $2,000. Yeah. Well. 140 got caught up in business various whatnots and it's already time to eat lunch haven't even started editing got an appointment appointment with the fun stuff accountant for taxes helping to do our taxes 330 that's just two hours less than two hours how's it going down there i have 11 more to sand down and then i'm hopefully gonna put the cabinet. final coat on Okay, 142 checkup on Jason. He's got a wall up. He's got a styrofoam. Two sheets. Two sheets. Yeah. Okay. I'm about to you put even the got third. A, what? I'm about to put the third one up. And you got it. Oh yeah, right. <laughs> we have no space in here anymore. It's not gonna be a walk-in cooler prison, anymore. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well we got a lunch for you, buddy. All right. No tummy tillio sauce Tillos? for him. <laughs> no. I'm sorry. That's no, okay. It doesn't oh. really go with broccoli soup. <laughs> oh, she's got some for you to sample. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Is it California tasty? Let's see. Does it pass the California test? It's tasty, yeah. Okay. <laughs> well, do you like it spicy or are you okay with it mild? I like it spicy, but it actually, it has a good flavor to it. As long as it tastes okay. good, right? We're winners. <laughs> we like it mild. You're the last one here. I think you're the least excited about the, what's in store for you in that, for that shit. <laughs> I know, I don't wanna go All right. Well, I gotta edit. Oh, it's 2.15. Go we got a meeting in an hour. Okay, what's the plan, buddy? Are you on, are you on schedule? Um, I think I'm it, a little behind. Insulation on walls? Yeah, just because of the insulation. You having a hang up? No, it's just a little tedious. Tedious, more tedious than you thought. Yeah. Okay. You're just putting layer after layer, you're gluing, layering, and taping, and you're pretty much doing it everywhere. Okay. So. I bet you'll get that wall up, huh? Or which, where are you going next? <laughs> this is the wall I want to do next. Okay. I bet you'll do it. This is the last wall. All right. <laughs> okay. Sent down to edit now. All right, I am headed down. 
back to sanding off the rough parts and such. I did do a little bit more of cleaning down there to try to get the dirt cleaned up. I mean, it is a barn, so can't really expect it to be too clean. I think it looks so good. Once I get done with the kitchen and all the painting that I have, because after this, there's still more painting. Um, but once I get done with that, then I'm focusing my efforts down here on some organization. Once upstairs is pretty much done. <laughs> I'm done with the things, the cabinet doors and drawers. Oh shoot, I didn't do the drawers. I'm not done, just kidding. Although I don't know if they need it. Now to clean them and to hopefully put the final coat on them. End of day. Looks like you made your goals. Yeah, I think so. Uh, insulated both walls. <laughs> <laughs> Look how thick. Yeah. Whoa. That's gonna be efficient, don't you think? It should be, yeah, I think so. Well, I got a little bit done. 20 more minutes to edit. For every minute of raw footage, generally three minutes for editing. So, an hour left, and it is time to eat supper. Grandma, Big Daddy here. Oh my, yes. I'm Mexican. Ooh. Look at this. Good. Are you serious? Cultured cream. For our beef, and that's our beef, our salsa, and our tomatillo salsa. Right. 